Hey everybody, thanks for watching. Uh, today we're gonna try a new technique that uh, just uh, started catching some fish on. It's uh, become really popular here in Minnesota here in the last couple of years. Uh, it's called the chicken jig or, or Minnesota mullet. Northland makes one called the Minnesota mullet. Uh, Outcast Tackle makes one called the chicken jig. Uh, back in the old days, uh, down south in the reservoirs, they would call it a preacher jig, but basically it's just a gigantic hair jig, three quarter ounce or five eighths ounce uh, hair jig. And we're doing a fast reel and then pause. And it catches, doesn't catch a lot of fish, but it catches big ones. And I'm um, here with my buddy, Mark. Say hi, Mark. Hey, Jason. Hey, guys. And uh, we're uh, trying it out so far. We've caught a few and uh, you're gonna see the catches right now. I don't have my uh, Voselka chicken rod, which uh, I caught them on here uh, last week. Uh, I left the rod stupidly at home in the garage. So I'm just using a flipping stick and uh, I've lost a couple fish because of that. So uh, wish I had my Voselka chicken rod here, but uh, gonna see some fish catches on the old chicken jig right now. Big it. Yeah. I'll be on this side. Or big, right? big. On this side. Yeah. Kill that one. No. That's got to be a five pounder, though get the scale out five point zero nine hold her up away from your face there you go got it Not quite as big. It's a pretty good one. You want to bring him in, or? Yeah. I just got the pole, man. <laughs> what are you doing? Just reeling quick and stopping? You want a picture of that one too? No. Three pounder. Nice. Yeah, there's like four of them right there. They're out in like 15, 16 feet of water and they're suspended up to about 10 feet. And they're all... There's one. Good one. Nah. It's a big one too. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, the old Minnesota mullet chicken. You not quite as big, but four pounder though. Oh man, what a bite. Oh my God, he come off. That was a real big one. God dang it. Oh. 
I don't have my Voselka chicken rod. I left it in the garage. I just got like this flipping stick and it, I've lost two or three fish now. Bummer. Nah, I don't think so. It's a good one, but... Oh, uh, yeah, I will need the net. Yeah, I'm gonna need the net. It's a bit bigger than I thought. Another picture. Oh, he swallowed it. Whew. He swallowed it. Hit it on the fall. That one's four and a half. Catch him, hopefully you can see this, catch him on the crappie colored Northland Minnesota mullet. Also have caught some on the chicken jig by Outcast Tackle, but uh, they really seem to be liking this crappie one today. That's a beauty there, it's second biggest one. That's four and a half pounder. Drop shot. Sun deal. There's another bite. No. Drop shot. Nice keeper. They stopped biting the hair jigs, so. Pick up a drop shot. Swallowed it. He wasn't coming off. Oh, bleeding. Bleeding, nice fish, two and a half. Another one. Oh, he's fighting like a big one. Yep, it's a big one. I'm going to need the net on this one. Not a giant giant, but... Not a giant giant, but a decent one. Oh, he come off. <laughs> Three and a half. Do that. It's 
nice one. A nice keeper. Yeah, two pounder. There's one. Better one? I can't tell. I mean, it's not a little one. I don't think it's a giant. Here he comes. <laughs> Decent one. Oh, come off. Uh. God, he's oh, there's one. Straight up. Oh, yeah, decent. Tail walking. Yeah, I'm gonna need the net on this one. Right. Yeah, I can net him. It's a pretty big one. Okay. Now you got it. Now you got it. Yeah, it's a big one. I got such a light line. Pounder. Here. Plus. The skin hooked. Oh, he wasn't coming off though. Oh, great big one again. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I let him eat it, too. God. Well, that's a wrap for us. It's just about dark, and uh, the fish have stopped biting. So uh, we took a, a brief little recess when we uh, loaded up the boat when a storm looked like it was going to hit us. It ended up not hitting us. And uh, so we headed back out on the water. The... Uh, the big hair jig bite was over with, but uh, I picked up a drop shot and caught like uh, five or six or five or six bites in the first five or six casts. So uh, caught the majority of the rest of the fish then on the drop shot, lost several nice fish too, and caught a couple on a Ned rig too. But uh, overall, great night out fishing. Hope you enjoyed uh, the chicken jig, Minnesota mullet. Uh, tutorial uh i guess you'd call it um i'm just new to this uh big hair jig game but uh, it's a lot of fun it catches big big fish and we caught some caught some nice ones tonight uh, and the drop shot caught a few nice ones too so thanks everybody for watching please subscribe and we'll see you out on the water